Shoto's ASMR Patreon over Shoto's moans on streams. I mean, I think that's uh, yeah, that's that's obviously a, a yes, dude. I mean, yeah. <laughs> this person's down bad. I think that's all. That's all it is right now. They're just being down bad. Um. Yeah. I mean, it's it's it's. <sighs> It's acting, right? It's 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 supposed to be better. It's supposed to be better, guys. I'm, I'd be a, I'd be kind of ashamed if you thought my moaning on streams was better than the one meant for, you know, the actual ASMRs. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna move on from that one. <laughs> Anyways, uh, can you give us a sample? Fuck no! I'm not gonna do that. That's 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 gonna be Dona Wald. Why? Why can't we just like both guys? Why can't? Why do we have to pit them both against each other today? Like, for real? Why you gotta do this to me, man? Why? Ass. Ass is. I love ass. Okay. I love ass a lot. You have to understand this right now. I'm being very serious. You do, you don't know who you're talking to. Like I I like boobs too, right? You can't just say one is like superior than the other. I like both, but like I have a preference, right? I don't think it's this is not a good say. Ass is just so much better for me because like it's a connection. Like you you get the part of the leg too. If you're saying you like ass, that means you're a leg person. You're kind of like a thigh person too, you know? Like legs, thighs, that area is just so good, right? Every like it's just so nice, right? And boobs is also good. Yeah, they're they're great too, right? I, I'm a good- I'm a big fan of boobs, too, and- oh wait. I forgot to turn off my echo. <laughs> I'm sorry, I forgot to turn off the echo, my bad. Um. <clears throat> okay, okay, but, like, uh, back to my point. It's like, it's a nice- it's a nice area, it's like, damn, like, being- I don't know. I just like imagine using having a lap pillow being smushed in between some legs and thighs, and like having an ass pillow. The butt is just so booty is appealing as hell, man. I love booty, right? Boobs are great too. I love boobs. Boo, like everybody can have like great boobs and. <sighs> man, why? Why you gotta? <sighs> I don't, I don't want to be in this situation, man. I just, you're making me choose pretty much, right? No, no, I'm not going to give you what you want. I'm just saying, I just like one more, a little bit more than the other, but I acknowledge that both are great, dude. Both are fucking awesome. I'm more of a butt person. That's it. Like I look at breasts and I get, I'm just like, damn, that's hot. That's really hot. But I feel like when I look at booty more, right? I'm just like, God damn. God damn! God damn, man! But it's just—it's different for me. Just respect that, right? Uh, I—I'm a butt guy. That's—that's that's all. Men that wear compression shirts and gray sweatpants are sl are gray sweats are sluts. We all know you be taking them TikTok thirst traps on the low. Don't lie. What the fuck are you talking about? Dude thinks I have a separate side account on TikTok to make thirst traps of myself. What are you talking about, my guy? No, I don't. You're calling me a slut? How is how is wearing a compression shirt and gray sweatpants slutty? How is that slutty at all in any way? It's just a it's just an outfit. That's not slutty. Dude, that's just like a gym outfit, man. Or like just something casual. Why am I being called a slut for wearing that, huh? <laughs> I feel like it, I feel like it, but for all the things to to call me a slut over, um, I don't think uh, I don't think this is uh, a very good, very good uh, example. 
explain then how about you in the chat like uh explain what you mean by this yeah how does it make somebody slutty to wear compression shirts and sweats it just feels like a casual outfit you know mm -hmm. now you gotta show your boob off hort oh my <laughs> Dude, bro, it, it does show off the booba well, I will say. Hmm, I will say. My good sir, with all my heart, with respect and love, you need help with the Instagram stories. You give off the vibe of a boomer dad. No, I don't. What do you mean by that? Wait, bro, what do you mean? What the fuck do you mean by that? You're so right. What? That's so mean. That's so mean. I'm hurt. Yo, I'm hurt. The hell are you talking about? I don't do stories, guys. I'm not I'm not part of the story culture. Like, I don't know what the fuck. You kind of do. Oh my god. Stop using the ugly font. Fuck off, man. I don't know what to do. You're making me feel I feel fucking embarrassed now. Like, damn, you're making me feel self-conscious about myself. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> what do you what do you mean by that, dude? What's wrong with my stories? <laughs> I'm just taking pictures of me going out and shit, and I might go live, or if like I'm at the gym, or ah, uh, now, dude, I'm self-conscious. You know what? You, I, now I'm not gonna post on Instagram anymore. Dude, yeah, I'm not gonna post on Instagram anymore. Fuck you, making me embarrassed and shit. Jesus, why? Why? Why you gotta? Why you gotta say that? Why you gotta say that, man? <laughs> 